Are you tired of the 9 to 5 rut? How'd you like to tell your boss off and go to work for yourself? Take this job and shove it. I ain't working here no more. As more and more Americans become dissatisfied with their lot in life, a growing number are trying to go into business for themselves and become, in a word, an entrepreneur. Come on, I own every hotel on the strip but that one. Come on, Howard, don't you have enough hotels? I'll pay your price, J. Paul. <laughs> it's not for sale at any price. I've got to take a chance. Damn it! What is it, Howard? Go directly to jail. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. Moving to Montana soon. Gonna be a dental floss tycoon. Bob Schwartz is the director of the School for Entrepreneurs. An entrepreneur is essentially someone who takes the risk, both the financial and the emotional risk, the personal risk, for starting a new venture. What is your motivation? There's a growing number of schools and seminars to train people in entrepreneurial arts. Most would-be entrepreneurs are in their 30s and already hold down good jobs, but there seems to be a common thread of dissatisfaction about taking orders from someone else. While many people think of an entrepreneur as a millionaire wheeler dealer type, money often isn't the most important element. Uh -huh. Talk about cash money. His principal interest is not money, though this is thought to be the case. It turns out his principal interest is a sense of personal achievement. The true entrepreneur regards each failure as only a learning experience. We don't get fooled again. At the entrepreneurial seminars, hopefuls are walked through the steps of what it takes to start a business, find investors, and deal with other problems and the joys of being one's own boss. But even with determination, capital, and a good idea for a business, being an entrepreneur is far from easy. Most new businesses fail. The fact is, the only work that really brings enjoyment is the kind that is for girl and boy man. The truer you are to your own convictions, like an artist wanting to paint what he wants to paint, the more successful you'll be as an entrepreneur. I want to be a commercial success So I can be just like the rest Business may not always be booming for the new entrepreneurs, but for those who train them it certainly is. Welcome to the work in a week oh, Welcome to the work in a week Produced by Mark Berman, I'm Steve Crowley on the News Blimp. Woo!